Hey, it's Shay. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well. I think today, this is day number three on this farm. Island. Gotta learn to say island. Um, we're going to work on maybe some of the quests that we have here. And um, try to get some bug catching and maybe maybe some fishing in we'll see and I definitely want to go turn these coffers in so let's water let's get some water and water these crops since one of the quest is to harvest your crops but before I get into all that I want to make sure everybody's doing well are you playing Coral Island since the release the early access release on the 11th and if so, in the comments below, tell me what you think about it. What are you excited about for the game? Is it what you expected so far? And we have to realize that in uh, early access that not everything is available yet to be tested and played around with. All of the, uh, from what I'm understanding, the uh, festivals and things of that nature are not quite complete yet. Um, and that's to be expected in early access. So be gentle on stairway games. Uh, they are allowing us to purchase and play the game early and in hopes to maybe get some bugs fixed. Um, so when the game releases next year, it will be a smooth release for them and for all the gamers that would like to play it. And I think that we probably won't see it on the switch for another year if not a little bit longer so which makes me kind of sad because i'd really like to be playing this on the switch and i'm really looking forward to controller support so anyways enough of my jabbing let's get these watered and then we'll head into town and see if we can go to the blacksmith and get these coffers opened up Big debate here. Waffles or pancakes? Which is your favorite and why? I'm a waffle kind of girl. I like it because the butter and the syrup look like gets down in the little crevices and mm. I haven't been able to eat waffles or pancakes for a really long time. I've been on a, uh oh, what do we have here? Is it a rape? Is it a rape or it's kind of looking like maybe a riot? You're not welcome here. Uh oh. Yeah, it's a riot. They're angry. They are angry. Karen. <laughs> Let the memes ensue. Hello, all. She looks like, quote unquote, Karen. If your name's Karen, that's no offense to you. It's just the meme about Karens. I don't want anybody to be upset about that. I actually think Karen's a beautiful name. Okay, let's see what everybody's upset about. Passionate residents of Starlet Town. All this commotion is unnecessary really Karen because I have a feeling what you're about to say caused this mess here pufferfish isn't here to do anything destructive mm -hmm. quite the opposite actually we're here to bail this town out Betty enough with the lies miss pufferfish you tell him grandma we can all see what you're here for. Don't mess with Betty. Note taken. You can call me Karen. <laughs> and we will. And please do elaborate, Miss Betty. Oh. You go on, Betty. The oil spill that reached our town last year was your doing. These old bones have seen enough of your atrocities. Well, 
Okay. I think she's going to dot her eyes out. Uh-oh, Pablo's got something to say. We don't want an oil drilling company around, Miss Pufferfish. Okay. Please stop now and take the drilling away from here. Look at this one taking pictures right here. She's going to get the scoop, put it in the paper. I'm afraid it's... I'm sorry, let's try that again. I'm afraid it isn't up to you. But yes, yes, we hear you. We're an oil drilling corporation, but things are not always as one-sided as Miss Betty suggests. Karen, I don't know about you, but I don't think I'd mess with Grandma. She walked right up to the steps there. Frank has something to say now. Let's see. We don't need your dirty... If I may, red shirt. Oh! Did she just call him Red Shirt? We can make Coral Island lively again by bringing in tons and tons of workers here. Nobody asked for that, Karen. Nobody. Once we turn the museum into a storage facility for oil, expand drilling sites to the lake and across the beach, see where I'm going here? You must be going right out of the town. I can see plazas with vending machines around town, parks. Many of our workers will want to relocate to this dying town. Mm. Pufferfish can help Coral Island become a magnificent oil town. You see, creating jobs and attracting our internal talents. Mm. In no time, you all will see this town alive again. Picture this, Pufferfish workers everywhere chilling by the pier inside fishing sips enjoying life red shirt look at the big picture here let's face it nobody cares anymore about this uh charming little island let us bail you out expand our operations here on coral islands coast that will make this island a world-famous oil town. Wow. Okay, Karen. We're putting you on the map. All you need to do is say yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jack. And by bailout, you mean drilling around the island. Grunts. Mm. Pufferfish's investors will make a hefty profit. Do the math. It'll trickle down to you people. You people? She's really pushing my button. Folks, let's cool our heads. Nothing will be solved if we act out of emotion. Miss Karen, thank you for your time. I ain't thanking her for nothing. Our door is always open, Mr. Mayor. All right. Is Betty going to get her? Is Betty going to get her? Oh, no. Betty said I'm done with you. Why am I sticking around? Wait, I don't want to stick around. I'm going to go there and play putt-putt. Freya, right? Oh, I know you. Mm. Pleased to make your acquaintance. No need to be confused. You don't know me. I'm Karen. I'm with Pufferfish Corporation. I know who you are. I just listened to that whole debacle go that was going on right there. Freya, this island is dying. We both know it. These people... They're just in denial. We should just make the best of it. Mm. Pretty sure I'm not on your side, Karen. Pretty sure. Okay, Jay, what does this say? Okay. 
so these are things tasks that I need to get done so we need to let's learn how to farm we gotta plant the seeds water the seeds and harvest my first crop the carpenters can fix your new home but you'll need to gather some resources first visit them once you've gathered enough wood and stone okay so I need to visit the carpenter today I need to go to the blacksmith to open the coffers and then I need to make friends. I need to give five townies a gift. Flowers usually will do the work in these types of games. So we'll see if I can go gather some of those. Okay, so first we'll go to the blacksmith. Let's see where we can find that. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Well, that was lucky. Okay, blacksmith. All right, let's go there. Okay, and by the way, you can toggle uh, sprint speed on um, in the settings. So all you have to do is direct her around okay it should be up here somewhere oh i just passed it okay and always check the trash can did that in stardew valley a lot oh are they closed already what's the time oh okay not yet okay we still got time so we can look for Y'all, I did my second TikTok today, and it has to do with this, with this little merry-go-round right here. Wee! <laughs> oh, TikTok can be a fun little thing. It's, I mean, literally, I've done two, but it was a lot of fun. All right, do I have anything in my bags that I can give to anybody? Nobody wants any of that. Okay, so I don't have any, even any spots in my bag. Let's put that away and put that in the trash so I can have a spot to open this up. And I'm probably going to need this. Oh, I'm going to go all the way back. So we'll get one open and see what happens. Okay, come on, nine o'clock. Let's go. Ding, ding, ding. That was a cute little sound. Okay. I love the interiors of these buildings. I love them. Okay. Let's see. So I guess I'm going to have to scroll over it and let's talk to him. No, I don't want to give a gift. I want to process geode or coffer. Okay, that's what I want. Let's put one in there. Uh-oh. What's that? An agate ring. Okay, can I do this? Oh, that's an artifact. And are both of these artifacts? That would be something I would think would go in the museum. Oh, let's click the button. Shay. So we can get out the door. Okay. Can we do anything with the museum yet? Okay. So I, I was going to go to the carpenter. But let's go to the museum. Is it this? No. Nope. Let's go down. Oh, maybe it is down there. Okay. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Let me know. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. All right, let's go down the stairs here. And, okay, here's the museum. Boy, I'm getting lucky with finding stuff. Okay, wait a minute. Another cutscene. All right, let's, let's talk to this guy here. He's upset about something.
Okay, hi, Scott. Nope, they haven't magically returned. Uh-oh. Oh, hello there. You're Freya, right? I'm sorry you caught me at a bad time, but... Just look at this. It's so empty. My life's work. Oh, Scott. I'm so sorry. Thanks, Freya. I worked so hard to fill the museum. Well, what happened? Well, it wasn't completely filled up, but at least it's not empty like this. Oh, what happened, Scott? Not gonna lie, when Millie told me the town was going to sell all of our collection, I was furious. It's not a feeling that I'm used to. Oh, who's Millie? The one thing I was good at that made me feel useful is going to be taken away from me. I couldn't stand it. Well, that makes me sad. But deep down, I knew the town really needed the extra fun to clean the oil spill. There wasn't much I could do about it. So I went back to my folks to cool down and think about what I'm going to do next. That's when I realized I had two options. Am I going to continue the pity party? Or am I going to rebuild the museum's collection now that the town isn't in, his, in an immediate crisis? <laughs> Words are hard. So is this where I come in you need my help? Yeah, is this where you need my help? That's right. I'm going to rebuild the collection. Yes. By the way, Freya, I've heard some things about you. Uh-oh. What have you heard? People tell me you're good at finding things. Now, I'm not too bad at it myself, but it can certainly, I can certainly use that skill of yours. If you find anything inter interesting, why don't you bring it over? Y'all, I can't talk today. Let's see, sounds like a lot of work. I can bring anything. Maybe, uh, well, maybe, will I get paid? Let's not upset Scott. Let's say I can bring anything. Not anything, anything. We have a list of items we want to display. Things like historical artifacts, fossils, critters, sea creatures, and so on. That kind of sounds familiar. Blathers, I mean, Scott. Did I say that out loud? Just drop by whenever and we'll see if anything in your bag can be displayed in the museum. I just so happen to have a few things here. So what do you say, Freya? Want to help me fill the museum with the treasures of the island? Of course I do. It's one of my favorite things to do. That's what I like to hear. Okay, can I donate to because I've got stuff now okay I've got a chipped helmet and an agate ring anything else nope doesn't look like anything else okay this is seen combat a faint reflection can be seen deep within the gym that's a little scary all right hit J and then we can complete for 150 of the coins okay all right we're doing oh look this is okay so it puts that's cool uh when the ring is bigger than the helmet the ring is bigger than the helmet okay here we go what what do we need to do now go to the carpenter and let's see if we can find Carpenter on the map. I bet that's it with the hammer here. Okay. So where are we? Okay, we're here. So, oh, we're not far. Okay. Hit the shift key. Oh, who are you? Hi. Oh, you're Freya. I've heard about you from my uncle, Joko. The Carpenter? 
Uh, that's who I'm going to see. Tall mustache. No. Okay. Yeah. I, I'm going right there. Carpenter. Oh, and these. These are dig spots. And we're supposed to dig these up. Kind of like the little squiggly digglies. And well, that's what I call them in Stardew Valley. <laughs> little worm looking things. Okay. So that's what these are kind of like. Oh, there's Joko. Okay, let's see. Can I go in here? Wait. Okay. A little bit. All right. Repair your house. Please help yourself. I mean, help myself. I found some wasabi earlier. Is it even in season? Okay, shop. Carpenter. Wait a minute, what am I supposed to be doing? Okay, well, we're not ready to do that, so let's see. Shop. Oh, okay. Calendar. Aquarium, that's cute. Big aquarium. I need some building resources. Okay, well, I have some. How many do you need? Upgrade house. Okay. I was just not hitting the right thing. Confirm. Awesome. Thank you. I'll work on it right away. All right. Joko, honey. A slight change of plans. Freya's here, and they've collected all the materials. Let's head over there and repair the house. Yes. Let's do it. Okay. The details in this game are amazing. Wow, that's awesome, Freya. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Okay, we're all going. Then Denda and Joko start repairing your house. How about it? Looks and feels more comfortable, right? Now let's move your body to help me get your stuff inside, kiddo. Now let's move your body. Oh, okay, I see. Reading words in the right context helps. Oh, yeah, high five. Much better. Look at us. Look at us doing things. Ooh, that old thing was really heavy. We're finished. What do you think, Freya? I love it. Looks brand new. Thank you. I don't want to be rude. They helped out a lot. <laughs> Is it? I'd say we can do better. Look, no more moldy wood. Thank you. We replaced all of it. We also built a new foundation for the house. Great, so I won't sink into the ground. That means it's strong enough for more furniture now. Good. My favorite. I love to decorate. You can start decorating to make things comfier. Speaking of decoration. We have a furniture store in town. Of course you do. But since there are fewer tourists, we don't stock many options anymore. No one's buying, you know. Oh, this town makes me sad. I need to help. Check it out, though. You might see something you like. If you want, we can go there, right? All right, that's enough. You'll scare the kid. I don't scare that easily. Sorry, you had to get a drink. Oh, sorry, Freya. I got too excited there. It's okay, Joko. We love that store. Even got some of my cousins helping out there. It's a family business for us. Feel free to visit when you have time, Freya. I sure will. It's in the middle of town. Shouldn't be hard to find. I don't know. Have you seen this town? It's kind of big. All right. That's all for... 
honey, aren't you forgetting something? Hmm. Oh yeah, the TV. We threw in a free TV for you, Freya, free of charge. Thank you. It's old and bulky, but it still works perfectly. That's fine. It gets a good amount of channels too, like this weather. Oh, she she kind of had to smack it a little bit. Well, sometimes you got to smack it good at a 60 degree angle like this. The channels are very useful. Like the weather report on the weather channel so you can skip watering the crops on the rainy days on rainy days to go fishing or something. I don't know what you like to do, but you get the idea. There are a variety of shows too. Love them. Some shows have useful tips if you pay close attention. I guess that's all for now. See you around, Freya. See ya, Freya. Don't forget about the furniture store, all right? Your house just got bigger. That's good. Okay, so... What do we need to do out here? Do we need to clear some things? Let's clear some trash. Oh, wait. You know what I need to do is I need to uh, collect some trash because I think, yeah, you have to have 10 trash and 25 wood to make a chest. And I need a chest to put our goodies in. So let's get to clearing some trash. Okay, is there any more up here? Oh, there's some here. Okay, good. Okay. We should have enough, but I will go ahead and finish cleaning this up. Okay, let's see. Do we have enough to make one now? Sorry, my dishwasher is being really loud. Okay. Um, we may have our chest. That's good. So let's go put it over here. We'll place it, I think. Okay, I see what you can do. Oh, you can't do that yet. Okay. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I'm going to move this here. Can't wait to get a bigger bag. All right, let's put that in there and that. I know that's going to be useful somewhere down the road. And that and the trash will too because we need it for crafting. Here's one of those little diggly doos. Oh, it's a hoe nib. And I still, you know what I need? I'm going to do this right now because normally I put this here, this here. Oops, nope, that there, and that there. Let's chop down. We probably need to chop down some more trees. Okay. Some of these trees chopped down. Gather some resources. Oh, I need to, it says I need to. Y'all gotta watch me. Open journal to claim reward. Okay. Well, that was a hundred. That's good. I need to start working on making friends. All right. 
Let's cut some of these big trees down so they're not in the way of our, like, point of view. So share with me in the comments down below, what games are you looking forward to? Are you guys going to be playing uh, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet? Are you Pokemon players? Or I'm going to, my husband and I will get both Violet and Scarlet. And we'll, of course, fight over who gets what. I bet you we're both going to want Violet. So I'll probably end up with Scarlet. And I don't like the legendary mount in that one. But it'll be what it'll be. And I'm looking forward to playing it. Um, I'm not a seasoned Pokemon player by any means. I literally uh, started not too long ago. I started with um, Sword and Shield. So I'm a little bit of a noob when it comes to Pokemon. But I'm learning. I'm learning. So if I do stream it, because I will be doing some lives, YouTube lives, don't make fun of me. Or make fun of me but do it nicely, please. I'm old. I'm old. Gotta be nice to the old people. Alright. That's better. At least there's not a bunch of big trees in the way. And we probably need more resources anyways. So, oh, I'm starting to feel tired. Okay, don't want to pass out. So, okay, let's not... Oh. Okay, and then I want to ship, try to ship one of that. Let's ship, oh no, not the whole thing, just kidding. Okay, you can do that. Uh, let's ship one of those, ship one of those, ship one of those, one of those. I like to ship one of like everything. Okay, I'm going to bed. What time is it? Oh, it's still early. Sorry about my phone. Um, because I can probably eat this, right? Yeah, consume the candy tree. Okay. So I can still do stuff. What do we want to do? Do we want to... Continue clearing out some stuff. I don't have any rock, so let's maybe get some of that, or stone, I should say. All right, here we go. There's some, oh, that's cool. Okay, that's going to be valuable, I'm sure. I bet that's going to be to make um, bars, you know, like, or um, bronze bars and gold bars, silver bars, things of that nature. I mean, if it is like any other farming sim type game, slice of life type game, then that's what they'll be used for. Sometimes cooking. I don't know. Is there cooking in this game? I should know that. I was a backer of, of the game, but... I'm sure there will be. It may not be in this version. But that is okay. Alright. Oh, I see some trash over there. We're definitely going to need that. So let's go get some... Oh, we're almost tired again. Okay, let's get some of this trash. And I wanted to go get some flowers... Okay. Let's can we oh sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Let's eat this, try to get a little bit more. So 
so we're not okay that's good let's go see if we can find some flowers oh i probably need to I don't have any inventory space of course let's oh let's put some of this stuff away in our little chest here uh, put that in there that in there that in there and put that in there let's move oh no I didn't, I didn't mean to do that okay let's go see if we can find some flowers oh you know what we haven't gone this way let's go this way Let's head up here and see if we can find some flowers in that way. Oh. Look at it. There's a peacock. Stop. Oh my goodness. I need all of them. A quail. Isn't that a quail? Did I just call this something that it's not? No, it's a quail. Pheasants look different. I thought it might have been a pheasant, but. Okay, they are stinking cute. Get out of here. I saw the little cows. Of... <gasps> Let me in. No. Look at the llama. Okay, I need every one of them immediately. With my 639 points what is that okay this must be one of the uh, critters that we'll be able to get I don't think we can get critters just yet but that's cute okay pig go play in the mud go play in the mud Stop it. Stop it right now. <laughs> so cute. I need a hundred of them, please. Right now. Okay. Cannot wait to get farm animals. Look, you go look for flowers and you find a whole petting zoo. Okay, what's this way? Oh, there's a flower. And a bug that I can't catch yet. Oh, they're fast. There's another flower. I gotta give these to people because I gotta give gifts to five. What is it? Uh oh. What is it? Five people? Making friends. We need to pin that as well. Yeah, five get townies gifted five of them. Okay. We can we can do that. I want to get that done. Wait, can I give you one? Do you count? Jack. Great, thanks. You're welcome. Did that count? One of five. Yes. Okay. We're making way now. I can't with them. They are so cute. Oh, there's another bug that I probably can't get. No, because I... Oh, I can't, y'all. Y'all need to, like, get in chat here with me. Or in the comments. I guess you can't get in chat until I can go live. Um, but I need help. Because, obviously, I didn't see the net here in my bag. Wait, who are you? Oh, bye. Where'd he go? Okay, what's this back here? What's this? Can I... Oh, oh it's a chest. Oh, the little candy tree seeds are here. And another bug that we can try and catch. How's this work? Oh, a pus moth. That sounds disgusting. He's pretty, though. 
Okay, tab for the journal. Oh, okay, so this is like our quote unquote critterpedia. Okay, so we got fish, insects, and sea critters. Oh, and then the produce. Oh, look at, look, wow. Look at all of that. Amazing found. Okay, so these are your artifacts, gems, fossils, and scavengeables. There's a lot of those too. Oh, and this tells you how long you play. Wait a minute now, I've cleaned some trash up. Does it not count when it's on your, what is this? I've walked. Okay. And then specials. I'm not sure what this is, but I'm sure maybe it's going to be like equipment or something that like maybe your diving suit will go here or something like that. Okay. I didn't, I did um, back the Kickstarter, but I didn't play in the alpha because I did not want to be spoiled. And I tried really hard not to watch videos. Um, because I didn't want it to be spoiled. I've been waiting for this for a long time and I wanted the excitement of playing it when it was closer to um, the early access because I knew it'd be a little more complete then. So anyway, enough rambling here. Okay. I better get back home. It's getting dark had so much I wanted to do. Oh, and that's another thing. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but in your settings before you start uh, your game session for the day, if you go into settings, you can move a slider for how long your day is, 100% being the shortest day and the lower percentage being it makes your day longer. Um, and I suggest, and this is just my opinion, take it for what you will, but if you have more time in the day at the beginning of the game to explore and to kind of get your bearings and get to do some of the quests and things, at first it makes it easier. If you like the challenge of getting whatever you can get done in a short time frame, um, then by all means play it that way. It's your game, play it how you want. But... I like to, I put mine down to, I think it was like 50 or 60% so I could have a longer day to get more things done because I, I y'all, I'm old. It takes me a time to get stuff done. All right, so do we have anything we want to ship out? Let's ship the shiitake. I don't want to get rid of the violet, but I like to give one of everything to the shipping bin. I don't know if this game is like that where you have some kind of achievement later on about giving everything in the shipping bin, but I'll do that. I'm not going to do that because that's definitely going to go in the museum. If I catch another one, then I'll put it in the shipping bin. All right, let's go to sleep. Let's go to bed. Let's see, we got a skill point. We can craft the candied tree seeds now. And we got one skill point and plus three max energy. Okay, what's the skill point all about? We didn't make much money, but that's okay. All right, new day. I want to know about the skill point business. Unlocked crafting recipe. Okay. All right, so mastery's lit up here with a little blue dot. Let's see. Okay, here. Okay, so it's like a skill tree. Foraging. Increases sprinting speed. This one's locked. Chance to forage double items. That's good. It's a 5% chance. And this one's chance for regular trees to drop hardwood. Hmm. Gosh, this is a tough decision because hardwood's probably going to be hard to find. 
it's typically in games and like if you've played Disney Dreamlight Valley you know it's kind of hard at first to get hardwood it's that same way in Stardew Valley uh, you have to upgrade your tools to get hardwood so it's only a 1% chance though this is a 5% chance to double foraging I don't know what do you think sprint speed I'm okay right now with the sprint it's 10% increase so uh, I'm okay because I'm sure that we're gonna unlock um, a fast travel type system here shortly at least I hope so because the map's huge all right let's say we're gonna go for I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for this one We'll get more skill points. Okay. Yep. We're doing it. Okay. Okay. So that's that. And this says that we have new the candy tree seeds. You need sap and any tree seed to make them. So that's good because that gives us back stamina. So I think that's what I'm going to do there. All right, I will, let's go out here and see if we have any mail. Oh, we have somebody at the door. Yes, good morning, I'm Mark. You're the new farmer, I know. I'm here to give you some information. The mine northwest of here is now open right through the forest, okay? When you see Jack's Ranch, you can go left and follow the path. It was closed. Yes, it was closed and now it's open. Make up your mind, Mark. Hmph. Find the ranch and go left. There should be a sign to lead you to the cavern from there. Catch any of that? The band of smiles cleared up the top levels of the mind. It's safe to roam. No monsters anymore. What do you mean, monsters? I don't want to go anywhere where there's monsters. You can visit if you're curious. Just don't go too deep. Your garden rake won't help you out there. Oh, that sounds a little serious, Mark. That's all. If you want to know more, talk to Kira. I'm done here. All right, well, that was very matter-of-fact. Waste of time. Well, you're a waste of time, jerk. What do you think he is? Oh, can we harp? We can harvest. There's that quest. Okay, we got that one done. All right. So Jerk Mark wants us to go to the mine, but I think that I'm going to save that for later. Let's water these here. I've been going for a while. I don't want to keep you all too long. So I will probably just end this here and tomorrow we'll do another day. We'll do day four on the island. But again, I thank you for stopping by. I hope that if you like this video, you will hit the like button. If you didn't like it, smash the heck out of that dislike button. And I will hope to see you soon and take care of each other and be kind. Have a great day.